Help for our hometown heroes. Those who make a career out of giving to others are now on the receiving end through a program that serves as a thank you for their service. It's tonight's NBC 26 Cares. Retired Lieutenant Colonel Rich Apple proudly served his country for 24 years. Returning home from a 15-month deployment to Iraq was a tough transition. You know, you go from carrying two weapons and machine guns on your vehicles to coming home to driving down the road and just going to work. Now principal at Chilton Middle School, his service to our community continues, and the Homes for Heroes program is saying thank you. It was actually started by a group of real estate agents in Minneapolis, and it was actually started after the 9-11 tragedy. They were sitting there thinking, what is something we can do as real estate agents to give back? The program spread to Northeast Wisconsin four years ago. This group of real estate agents, mortgage lenders, and title companies provide discounts to public servants who are buying, selling, or refinancing a home. Those who qualify include military personnel, police, firefighters, health care workers, teachers, and clergy. Everyone who gives so much of their time and energy and passion to the community, I think it's really great to be able to help them. Pam Beatty with Waterstone Mortgage covers the appraisal costs, and realtor Vicki Olson gives back 25% of her commission. I'm a military veteran myself, so um, it feels good to be able to give back. The average savings is $2,000, money Apple was thankful to keep in his pocket when he built his dream home in Chilton. It might not have been just the money, it was the gesture that I think that meant so much. Now he's helping spread the word through this celebration. <laughs> Hoping more hometown heroes will apply for the program and get the pat on the back they deserve. Homes for Heroes has given out more than $9.6 million nationwide. Apple says the process is simple. For details on how to apply, go to our website, NBC26.com, and click on this story.